Tammy Webster with Bull Riding Rodeo Connection. We're here at the RFD TV American, and we have the barrel racer today, uh, Lisa Lockhart. Lisa, you had a great run, and I know you've talked to a lot of people already about this, but uh, you did already know the times are before you and that the girls had all knocked down the barrels. How did that kind of affect you coming out? Um, you know, I, I knew in the back of my mind it was more crucial than ever to keep them standing, but it's really hard to change your game plan and do anything different or ride your horse any differently. So, um, you know, I just had faith in him that, and myself that I knew I could do my job. And, you know, he's, uh, he's such an extremely broke horse. And, you know, I've ridden him since he was four years old and trained him. So I mean, we know each other. And I know if I do my job and just place him where I needed to place him, that I could keep him standing. So that's what I tried to do, and it worked. Well, the one thing I noticed, the way this arena is set up, you don't really have much of an alley to come out in. How did that affect your horse and, and just getting him or her used to getting out of the... You know, it is difficult when you don't, you know, have a long alley to kind of get tapped off right, per se. Um, and so, you know, he was real good coming in on my first one. My second one, he was a little bit more hesitant. and um, But it is hard, you know, especially, you know, and we could pick whichever side we wanted to come in from but um, nonetheless you know it's more like a standing start out of the starting blocks type of situation and, and it's, and it's a little, quite hard actually but um, you know you just uh, every arena is different and and you have to be reactive to the moment and just do what you got to do. Well um, I know you mentioned your family too and you're um, they weren't able to be here with you but uh, they watched you I'm sure win and are very excited about it. Oh absolutely you know and um, you know we, we keep in touch all the time and so yeah I mean I've not actually got to speak with them yet we, you know there's just been so much that we've we've done here afterwards so um, but it would just be nice to, to when I walk out of this building and talk to them. Now when are you heading back home? You know, um, it will be after Houston and Austin, so providing I can uh, stick around for one of their short rounds, um, it will probably be another three weeks, so hopefully hopefully it's that long, and if not, I'll be done this weekend, and I'll be headed home, so either way, it'll be great. Well, congratulations again, and be careful on the road, because I don't know how well it's out there. We've had a lot of ice today. Yes, we have, so thank you. This is Tammy Webster, Bull Riding Rodeo Connection.